Dreads, are you in, uh, whatever? Dire team's turn to pick. Yes, all mine. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. Hawk again. See the picks and bands here. Radiant team ban. Bang. I don't know, I can hear you, Bulb. I'm trying to fix it. Laugh one more time. Ten seconds <coughs> remaining. Five seconds remaining. Free to play it. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. So, Radiant teams turn to power. All right, now I gotta get it. Blur master me. I just now I have to go. I'm um, actually just... wait. Oh, all right. One sec, please. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. Fix everything, you know, bolt pest run, but we'll, we'll get it. We'll get it working here. We'll get him back on. Hello, my bad. We're good now. Where you are good. Teams turn to pick. Tide hunter. No, you're good. You're great. I had to change it because I had to turn streamer mode off, but now I turned it back on, so now people can't just spam stuff. So now we're good. All right, bat rider, tide hunter. So two offlaners likely already taken. We've seen tight right, right tight under a lot at the what was the perfect Ten world minor. Remaining. But it's it's when do you pick a tide? Five seconds remaining. The situation. Radiant teams turn to ban. Anti-mage. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining.
Is it weird though? Uh, maybe it's just me. Like I see Sand King A and Razor, and you have super low cooldowns on all their abilities, and then you just have a Tide Hunter. But I guess like besides his ulti, good with those low cooldowns. Dire teams turn to ban. Dire teams turn to pick. Radiant teams turn to pick. Mirana. Seconds remaining. Jesus, Optic actually pausing the game during the draft. Five seconds remaining. Bulbo, if you were Kyle, would you be mad at that point? He, no, they, he paused and then unpaused it, and Kyle gave him the question mark. Said they fat fingered it. I mean, people say that, right? But I guess, especially, right, this is to go to a major. Like, would you really want to be the guy to be like, oh, yeah, we lost in the finals to X team? Well, I mean, you guys lost a few finals yourself, unfortunately. Who did you feel the worst losing to, honestly? Like, what team? Yeah. yeah. Life moves on. Instead, you get to watch Complexity Optic cast here with me, Bulba, you know? We've known each other for a long time, and it's always good when we can get on a cast together. Dude, I, I can't wait. Yeah, can you not wear short shorts this time? <coughs> Dude, I don't know, Sam. I've, I, I, I don't know. If, if that's what you say. You should, can you wear jeans one day for me? Back then. There's the last picks, man. I won't, so... This is a super standard complexity lineup, besides maybe... I mean, Z moves usually on the Sand King when they pick it, but they've been mixing it up a little bit. I mean, the Sven for Chessie, Limp on the Razor. <coughs> uh, it feels nice, and then last pick Mirana. What's the last pick Mirana for? Like, just... It, wh what build is it gonna be, I should say? The physical or the magic? <coughs> <laughs> Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. M ninety nine. All right, Bulba. We'll see if uh, the whole DC fiasco is your fault or. They actually go. Shit. All right, and then what would you have? You'd have a, a Tide Hunter versus the Bat Rider, which you said isn't that bad for Tide. Early game pause. For what? The battle resumes. Use wireless to R. I'll hold it down. So it is going to be complexity going up against Optic Gaming. This is going to be game number one of a best three. Winner just goes to a major. That's all there is to it. On the Radiant side, we're going to have Kyle playing that five position AA. We're going to have Limp on that middle Razor. Chessy on the carry spin. Z Freak. Not Moo will be on that Sand King roaming around, and then there you have it. Moo on that tight under 10 tangos ready to go on the other side. CC and C, not their captain in the pink spot, though, playing the Marana on middle lane. We're going to see Zai on the off lane bat rider. Piecat with the anti mage. It's been a while since we've seen him not banned out or picked, and then it's going to be Soxa 
on that four winner wyvern arctic burn already skilled and then peter on that annoying bane and feeble brain set real lane winner am i right bulba he dropped a smoke Thirty seconds to battle. That. Yeah, CC and C is still just. I mean, he's sitting up the rune. He has the normal middle build with the two. Is he just blocking in there to look at the lanes first, maybe? That's what it looks like. It looks. Yeah, they're just scouting out the lanes by doing this, and now Pycat's bottom. You like, I mean, AM ver no one's right, Tide does really good versus melee, but with the mana break, does it make it, nah, how hard is this lane for an AM? I mean, he'll have a little bit of help, it looks like, from the Winter Wyvern. Don't worry, I caught it. I caught it, Bulba. No, I mean, why so? That's just a, a class right there. He, wait, he didn't even use arrow. That was a, a kill without arrow. They just ran limp down. That's a rough one. This this Tide game, it seemed good like a, for Tide, right? Either lane he went to versus Batrider, he's going to get farm and experience versus uh, this AM he's going to. It just seems like they really want their Tide to work out, but they are going to go on him bottom. But they can't really kill him. I mean, like you said, with two five heroes, they don't really do that much damage. But Z Freak probably gonna stun him here to steal it. Will do. That is pretty easy. I just gonna have to fly away. Man, this feels bad. A safe lane bat rider who'd have guessed still level one, not even level one and a half yet. Two minutes in. It's middle matchup though. It's one two versus six five. The CCNC is, is getting beat pretty bad right here. 